Hello, everyone, and welcome to First Baptist Church of Crystal River. My name is Pastor Tim Lancey, and here are the announcements for Sunday, January the 8th. Now that Christmas and New Year's are over, our worship services have returned uh, to their normal times. We have a contemporary service at 930 that meets in Victory Hall. We also have the traditional service that meets at 11 o'clock in the sanctuary. We also have on-campus Bible studies for adults at three different times, 8.30, 9.30, and 11. And this gives everyone an opportunity to attend a worship service and a Bible study as well. Our Wednesday evening ministries return this week on Wednesday, January the 11th. So at 6 p.m., we have the Awana ministry, and that's for children age two through grade five. We have youth ministry uh, for students in middle school and high school, grades six through 12. We also have the adult Bible study that meets in the sanctuary, and we are making our journey through the Gospel of Mark. Uh, we are right now in chapter five. And also the handbells practice Wednesday at 6 p.m. At 7 p.m. on Wednesday, that's our adult choir practice. And if you would like to join the choir, just show up for practice on Wednesday. It'll give you an opportunity to learn the song, and then you will sing that song uh, the following Sunday during the 11 o'clock service. Lottie Moon offering for international missions. We're just about ready to close that down for the year, but it's still not too late to give. Uh, we have a huge goal of $10,000. We have not yet uh, made that goal. Uh, so if God so moves you to give to international missions, uh, please do give to the Lottie Moon offering. The Manatee Festival is coming up next weekend. And that includes Saturday, January the 14th, and we have a group of people who want to minister to people who come through uh, our church property because our church property is located right on the very edge of the Manatee Festival. So from 9 a.m. until 4 p.m. Uh, next Saturday, uh, people will be handing out water, uh, we'll be cooking hot dogs, coffee, uh, also giving people some church information. So if you would like to be involved in this outreach project, uh, simply call the church and let them know that you're interested and then be there at the church next Saturday between nine and four. And you don't have to stay the entire time, uh, just whatever time frame works for you. And I know that our outreach team and some of our D-Life groups are participating in this outreach. So thank you for doing that. And it, there's still an opportunity to get involved next Saturday. Also wanted to let you know that the Manatee Festival continues next Sunday. This is the one festival that involves two days, both Saturday and Sunday. So just want you to know that next Sunday morning, January the 15th, that church parking is available. Uh, it may not look like church parking is available, but it is. And the best way to find and get to uh, our church parking lots is to go down Crystal Street. And there's a way to weave in and park in your normal spot. So uh, it's a little challenging, but uh, we've done this for years and we can handle that. And we've got people out there to help direct you uh, to the parking places. We have a new members class coming up in just a couple of weeks on Saturday, January the 21st. And that meets at 8.30 a.m., and you can sign up for that class either at church or by calling the church office. We have a business meeting uh, coming up on Wednesday, January the 25th. Uh, that will be at 6 p.m. and that will take the place of the adult Bible study for the evening. Uh, the final uh, budget numbers, expense numbers for 2022 will be presented. The leadership roster for 2023 uh, will be presented as well. And so it's a great opportunity to take a look at where we've been for the past year and also where we're headed in 2023. The shoebox ministry uh, grand total for this year uh, was 617 boxes that we put together. So thank you uh, to everyone who participated in that. And some of those boxes we have learned have gone to the countries of Niger, Congo, and Chad. 
So we often wonder what happens to those boxes after we collect them. And they do track each and every box and that's where some of our boxes ended up this year. If you would like your own copy of the bulletin, we can email that to you. And you can do that by sending me an email requesting the bulletin at Pastor Tim at firstbaptistcr.org. Or you can simply call the church office at 352-795-3367. And it works the same way with prayer requests. Uh, just send me an email or you can call the church office and we can be praying along with you for your prayer request. Well, those are the announcements for Sunday, January the 8th. And may you stay safe until we meet again. God bless you.